Special thanks goes out to Dan Polino and uh, everyone at PVC Only Google Groups. So today we'll be testing a uh, about uh, 1.8 newton, uh, 1.8 kilonewton second rocket uh, with approximately four pounds of potassium nitrate and sugar and corn syrup uh, for the mixture. It has a 0.705 uh, inch nozzle and um, I've heated this to about 70 degrees, 75 degrees, because it is rather cold today. Um, we'll be testing it on a platform that we built and, and installed in the ground here, and we'll have a couple of cameras on it. Um, this is an electrically ignited system, and uh, we'll hope it all goes well. Successful burn, case hand held. It's definitely very soft at this point. All in all, I'm pretty happy. Thank you. So what I learned, uh, the nozzle held up well. Uh, definitely some erosion. However, the washer was perfect. Uh, did not get damaged and uh, managed to survive the entire burn. Uh, the when I cut it open uh, to see how things operate internally. Uh, the only thing I found was that uh, towards the top of the rocket, there's definitely some plastic fatigue. Looks like it was going to melt through very shortly. Now that could definitely be something that happened after it finished its complete burn. So I'm not that worried about it. Uh, it is plastic after all, and there's a lot of heat. So um, something else, we'll not be using a pancake grill in the future. Uh, I'm going to be switching to a wok because the K450 that I plan to test next is going to uh, require considerably more amount of fuel. So can't use that pancake grill anymore. So the next rocket we'll be testing will be the full K450.